Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I am going to show you the difference between LogSeq versus Obsidian. When it comes to personal knowledge management and note taking, LogSeq and Obsidian are the two of the most popular tools used by knowledge workers, researchers, writers, and even hobbyists. Both are designed to help users create a network of interconnected nodes, but they take different approaches to organizing and managing information. LogSeq is an open source knowledge management tool designed for organizing notes, thoughts, and ideas in a graph based system. It uses outliner based thinking, making it particularly suited for those who prefer hierarchical structures. LogSeq's core feature is its outliner. Each page is structured in a bullet point format, allowing you to organize ideas hierarchically. This is excellent for managing tasks, projects, and knowledge that need to be broken down into smaller components. LogSeq users mark down by default but also support ORG mode, popular with Emacs users, allowing for flexibility in how nodes are formatted and structured. Like Obsidian, LogSeq offers a graph view to visualize connections between nodes. It uses backlinks to build relationships between your thoughts. LogSeq has built-in task management features, including to-do list, checkboxes, and tags. This makes it ideal for managing projects in a to-do list format while also organizing your notes. Your data is stored locally on your device, ensuring privacy and control over your notes. Being open source, LogSeq supports various plugins and community-created extensions to extend its functionality. LogSeq offers cloud sync options such as through Dropbox, GitHub, or self-hosting, though it's not as seamless as Obsidian Sync. LogSeq is free to use and has a very active community of developers. LogSeq is completely free to use with optional paid features for advanced syncing services. While Obsidian is a powerful knowledge management and note-taking application that focuses on linking your notes through backlinks and bidirectional linking. It is known for its graph-based approach and extensive customization options. Obsidian uses Markdown for formatting notes, making it very flexible and easy to export or share files across platforms. One of Obsidian's most powerful feature is the ability to create bidirectional links between nodes, which helps you build a web of interconnected thoughts and knowledge. Similar to LogSeq, Obsidian offers a graph view to visualize how your nodes are interconnected. The graph provides the holistic view of your knowledge and thought processes. Obsidian boasts a vast range of community plugins allowing you to add features like task management, daily notes, calendar integrations, and more. The plugin ecosystem is robust and constantly growing. The plugin ecosystem is robust and constantly growing. Obsidian offers extensive customization options, including themes and CSS tweaks to give the app a personalized look and feel. By default, Obsidian stores your notes on your local device, ensuring privacy and control over your data. With Obsidian Sync, you can sync your notes across multiple devices. Obsidian also offers collaboration features for teams with paid plans. Obsidian supports a daily notes feature which allows you to log your daily thoughts, tasks, and events. Pricing plan of Obsidian is Basic Obsidian is free to use, offering powerful note-taking, linking, and graph features. And the first one is Obsidian Sync, which is of $8 per month for syncing across devices and cloud storage. And the second one is Catalyst License, which is of $25, one-time payment for supporting development and getting early access to new features. And for commercial use, paid plans are available for teams and businesses.